very worn, but it's a uh, Sonic 2 from eBay find. And personally, Sonic 1 is quite rare to find. It's kind of expensive, around fifty to hundred dollar mark. So Sonic 2 averages up about twenty to thirty bucks, I think. So it was the cheapest one for about ten bucks, fifteen bucks. So I can't complain about twenty bucks. So we would have liked it to be in a little bit better condition, but I saved at least five bucks by getting this one. And they have the accurate pictures, so I can't really say much about that. This is me buying the cheapest one on there. So that's if you buy the cheapest one, and that's what you get from eBay. Because you're not there picking it, so you don't really know what they're going to send you. But a strong cartridge and I'll get some gameplay out of it. So I never played Sonic yet, so I never even played it on ROMs. So I used to have Sonic 2, thanks for watching. So I'll add a little something off eBay now, but it won't be much because eBay is getting kind of expensive out there. 50 to 100 bucks for a lot of older movie titles, older games and I need to be careful what I pick and choose off eBay now, so I might just pop in one or two things per month off eBay or every couple of months get a little something. Mostly I'll have to rely on thrifting and try to get something thrifting that way, but I don't find very many games thrifting. If I do, they'll price it up to eBay prices, 30, 40 bucks. They won't price it to 5 bucks like Goodwill or the other donation stores, so i would be careful what I pick that way. If I pick games out of the showcase or something, make sure it's priced around five dollar mark. So they like to price things up if they think it's a better title. So I just gotta be careful that way now too. But it's something I need. I'll I'll pick it up. So thanks for watching.